We're with Ed Egan, the senior receiver and return specialist, and I'm going to say it, All-American. What does it sound like to hear All-American in front of your name? Well, it's an honor. Uh, I worked hard for it, and, you know, it's good to hear that. So, what do you do for an encore? Um, well, that's what we have to see. Uh, right now, I can only focus on what I can focus on, so it's preparation. And here we are, really, at the end of that preparation. Pretty much from this day forward, it's really focusing on Southeastern. What do you think the team has gotten accomplished in preseason? Well, we've gotten a lot accomplished. Uh, just the playbook, all the quarterbacks getting used to the new plays and you know, just getting timing down and you know, just working. We still have a lot to learn, but we've come far, uh, a long way. Okay, we know we've seen these quarterbacks play and we know the coaches have a tough decision to make. Away from the field, what are these guys like? You actually uh, live with one of them. Yeah, they're all pretty funny, actually. All, they all have a good sense of humor, uh, always joking. But when it's time to focus in, uh, they, they focus and uh, they compete. Is there any particular non-football skill that any of these guys have? Um, yeah, they're all good at uh, well, Steven's pretty good at FIFA, uh, a little video game we, we like to play. Uh, it's, we all like joke around with each other about FIFA all the time, so I'll give him that. All right. Any of them ping pong champions or uh, uh, have a particular TV show? Or Well, I know Bear has a lot of skills. He's, uh, I know he's good at basketball. He's, he, he actually thinks he could play here, so... I mean, they got some good athletes out there. All right, and with Joel, what have you found out about Joel since you've been living with him? Um, he's a lot like me, actually. Uh, he likes to focus in and doesn't like to do crazy stuff, just hang out, relax. A lot has been made of his speed, 4-3, four, 4-4. Four, four. Yeah, he's a 4-3. And who's faster yeah. of the two roommates? Well. Uh, in the spring, he actually had me by a step, but uh, this summer I've been grinding really hard, and now he, you know, he'll, he'll let you know that I'm a little faster now. Very nice. Well, let's look forward now to a game I know that means a lot to you. Every game does, but this is one of the two neighborhood rivals we play. When we play near New Orleans, it's Southeastern, it's Nichols, and you're a New Orleans area guy. Talk about uh, what this game means to Ed Egan. Well, it means a lot. Um, you know, I've been working ever since the last last game last season so it's all uh, coming down to it last week so it's, it's getting the chills and we're getting ready and southeastern obviously has won the last two championships they've got some tremendous players on defense some guys are going to be really looking out to uh, try to slow you down uh, so from a personal standpoint i know it's an exciting challenge but you don't look at it from a personal standpoint do you no i don't um, it's a team effort and uh they have some great players, especially in the secondary, so it's going to be a challenge, but I hope we just come together as a team and you know, that's, that's how we're going to win. Talk about the excitement on campus right now and how in a week's time, 6 o'clock next Thursday night, whiteout game in Turpin Stadium, what do you think it's going to be like? I feel like it's going to be a good atmosphere. It's going to be a lot of fans. You know, a lot, hopefully we can get all the student body out here. So get loud and you know it's gonna be fun to play under that the uh, white helmets you guys seen them I guess you'll get to put them on a little bit and work them through practice what you know, what do you you know does that make any difference does that help or um, yeah I always think that you know if you look good you play good so I do like the white helmets but you know I don't know if we're gonna have them all season or what's the deal with that but to be fully white out is kind of cool I like that well, we're looking forward to to stay clean and get to the zone. Yep. Thanks, Ed. All right.